Brian here from quantlabs.net. Uh, um, I just wanted to post uh, a really powerful, uh, compelling video uh, from a webinar we did uh, last night. A person by the name of Ram, who's uh, one of my local meetup members on quant-finance and uh, our MATLAB users. Uh, he put on a uh, very awesome uh, introduction to R, uh, went in great detail, uh, it, literally like a cla crash course in R um, over two hours. Um, as part of that video as well, myself uh, in the first hour uh, talked about my new uh, updated open source Java high frequency trading architecture. Uh, so it's a total of a three hour video. Um, I, after this little segment, um, I'm going to play the tail end of it uh, from a lot of the uh, members that stuck it out um, for three hours um, and all the thanks and all the awesome stuff that we got. It just really pumps me up to keep delivering more stuff out there. And um, we're getting all kinds of emails today from people that were part of that um, presentation. Um, as I said, this, this uh, video that you're about to see is a complete three-hour video. Again, a two-hour session on R as an introduction. If you're new to R, want to learn about uh, R, you got two hours of, 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 of fantastic video from Ram. Personal thanks goes out to him. Also, um, as I said, the first hour is just me blabbing about my high-frequency trading environment, the components, and all that. So that's part of the membership. Um, it's affordable. It's what keeps us going. Uh, that's how we uh, uh, keep the lights on, so to speak, and allows us to eat our hot dogs so that we have sustenance for the next day. <laughs> uh, we're not making millions of dollars. Um, at least in my, in my, I'm a schmuck trading uh, and so on and so forth. Uh, I put a lot of effort into the research for this to, s to hopefully save people time and expedite their learning and hoping, and hoping that, they, that they can turn these endeavors that they uh, are part of and turn it into something uh, positive and, and profitable. That's the whole name of the game. Also, I'm going to uh, keep it really short. This, as I keep saying in my YouTube videos, this is the next generation in trading. Um, I don't know if you know, NYSC has now been approved for a dark pool um, for, uh, and that's been approved by the SEC. What does that mean? Dark pools are coming. Um, uh, it's just the way of the future. Secrecy in trading is coming. Uh, NASDAQ will be part of it, and from what I understand, in the reports that I'm hearing, over 50% of all uh, tr uh, trading activity is through a dark pool. If that's not scary, over 80% of uh, American-based trading activity is based off of not just an electronic trading system, but an algorithmic-based trading system. What does this mean for a retail investor? What does it mean for somebody who's a discretionary trader? You will at some point need to learn about algorithms, and HFT or high frequency trading, or at least systematic tra uh, trading. All the other um, platforms out there are just, it's just, it's just a ticket to unprofitability um, and uh, being traded against. They're just basically magic bullets People are looking to become a millionaire the next day, and they just all do it by pushing little buttons that say green going up, down going sell. Uh, that's not how you will be able to trade. You will lose so much capital doing it that way. Um, we are open, transparent, building a community. That's what we do. And here's this video, uh, which just demonstrates one of a small minute that we have available on our membership. And again, um, what we offer, uh, it, it's, it's so affordable, that's how we keep the lights on around here and, and it just keeps guys like me and Ram going and just putting stuff out there so other people can um, learn from it. But here's the video, hopefully you enjoy it. I'll put a link at the bottom uh, where to go if you are interested in joining. Thanks a lot and have a good one. Condition, everything, including the uh, command lines and how you've handled the whole thing. Truly appreciate all the hard work you've put in. We would like to thank you for staying so long to talk to us. Thank you. And anybody else want to chime in there for Ram? Uh, uh, Brian, I just, this is Kelly. I just wanted to say how much, even though I'm not a coder and I, I can't possibly appreciate uh, all the degree of effort and, and knowledge that uh, Ram has put into this and acquired, 
but I, I, I am. I have worked with coders uh, before around them, and 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 actually uh, supervised some in a way for different projects. And I just want to say how much uh, uh, how impressed I am, and how thankful I am for this level of uh, input. Uh, yep. It's it, it's a great gift. Like, you know, it's a it's a huge uh, just 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 a huge positive thing for our uh, project here. And 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 I wish Ram well, and I, and I hope we stay close to him. And I hope I hope you stay. Uh, I hope you keep him close as a good friend. Yeah, yeah. Well, I got, I'll put this up for Ram. Uh, I know he runs. An, he's an independent. If anyone wants to hire him, by all means, just put a, a, a blurb out to me. Uh, I want Ram to do, do well here he, for this group. He, he's done so much. Anybody else want to chime in for Ram? Go ahead. Um, yeah, thank you very much. Uh, I hope to be interacting with your group uh, more and more because uh, this is an exciting field. Uh, I've not uh, worked on trading before, uh, but I'm pretty much interested in the statistics and are of this uh, particular um, domain. So, any interesting problem you want to throw around, please throw around at me. I can give it give it a shot. Yeah, because I mean, um, just uh, uh, as a group. I, I mean, I know we have the paid component as a membership. I know some people are not coders or understand it. It is an overwhelming technology. It just is being recorded, so people can go through it on their own leisure. As I said, these, these, this type of presentation is worth literally thousands of dollars. There's no doubt about it. Um, anybody else want to verbally chime in? Um, the, the, the thank yous I'm getting on the chat mode is amazing. I wish you could see it, Ram. Um, I'll, I'll just blurb them out here. I got a thank you from Muhammad. Really nice work. Um, oh, a uh, question. Uh, let, let me just go through the comments before I get to you, Thompson. Um, Ram, thank you. Greatly appreciate it. Third said, wish I could. My mic is off, but uh, he really appreciates it. Okay. Um, there was a question about Revolution R versus R Studio. You want to take that, Ram? R was it? Revolutionary, uh, revolutionary analytics. Yeah. This is what revolutionary analytics have done. What they have done is they have taken the R um, and they they have really kind of certifying. This is a movement within the open source you have to appreciate uh, pretty well. <coughs> open source is not always free. Uh, it's free but then there are groups which take it and uh, kind of improve it. Improve it also guarantees the quality there and gives support services and then charge for it. So revolution analytics really have taken a version of R and made it a kind of high performance R and added the parallel component and hired people who have done, for example, Purdue University has done a package called RHIP, or uh, hype I think that's how it's called. Uh, they have done a parallel R. Revolutionary Analytics also have done a parallel R, but eventually they wanted to really merge the whole thing. And Revolution Analytics hired the guy who's done the work in the um, Purdue University so that their parallel R gets better. So this way, a guy who is really supporting this gets his regular money, support services, and can offer a quality service to people. So Revolution Analytics really is giving such an enterprise hard support. Uh, you would need such groups. Uh, without such groups, open source cannot survive. Um, the Revolution Analytics is not the, there are several of them. Revolution Analytics is just one of them. Um, same thing is happening in with the Hadoop world, like uh, Cloudera is taking up uh, Hadoop and taking it to the enterprise level. Similar to CDH, there are several people supporting Hadoop. So open source today, that model is really coming to force and I really like that model because that's the only way open source is going to succeed. Yeah, I, I can also say from the Hadoop world there's Cladera which is uh, like basically a commercialized package of Hadoop. Makes it easy for guys like me instead of having to manually install it. Um, as for revolutionary analytics, uh, they're part of the group. Their head blogger, I can't remember his name, David, I think it is. Uh, I'm going to reach out to them to see if they can maybe present to the group something, the revolutionary analytics, as well as the uh, Hadoop uh, component as well. And, and, and I think with, with you, Ram, as well, you, 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 may, you, you mentioned you may want to do a presentation on uh, Hadoop as well within R. 
Yeah. Um, actually, Hadoop and R, what we could do is we could uh, uh, find out if Revolution Analytics would be interested in hosting some seminar, and I would chime in later to probably give some clarification and things like that, subsequent uh, question and answer session. Uh, yeah. Incidentally, the, uh, one of the founders of the um, who's uh, Robert uh, Gentleman, right, the Canadian, Canadian guy who's uh, one of the founder of the R. He joined the Revolution Analytics uh, board at some point, and uh, I'm not sure whether he's still there or not, but he was the director at one point. Um, yeah, I, um, for, from my perspective, I mean, you've seen the power of R and the capabilities of R uh, in terms of from the MATLAB world to R, I, I do know Matt, math works is very scared of R. A lot of other um, vendors are very scared of R. Um, I, I was skeptical of R maybe a year ago, but now that I've seen R and what it's capable of, um, I'm very sold on R and I'm, I'm throwing a lot of effort into R as well. It's just an amazing, amazing platform to work with. See, it's, it's um, exactly like the good old days where you throw the C or Java into universities and out come the graduates who are all who know only that. The same thing is happening with R. Every statistics department out there is only teaching to R. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And um, as 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 Ram mentioned about um, the the Hadoop, um, I've I've, exper I've experimented a lot with R and you know using the more next generation NoSQL databases and all that. Um, from my perspective, I know our, uh, Ram's got the Hadoop solution working. I played with it. Um, I'll be doing a future uh, presentation on Redis, using Redis, which is similar uh, to Hadoop, um, and that will show off the capabilities of clustering and parallelization within R. Um, with Redis, you'll see how easy it is to um, set up a, a small uh, uh, clustering um, network. It, it just is so easy. It's very powerful. It's all in memory. It's all open source. It's all, again, free, and, and I'll do a presentation that, on that. Uh, fairly soon. Um, any other questions uh, before we wrap it up uh, in the chat mode? I've muted everybody, so you just have to just type out a question if everyone's got a question at all. Um, I guess not. Uh, as I said, uh, we'll resume the uh, online webinars come probably the first week of September. Um, so we're going to do the social one next week, uh, a week today, and then we'll resume all this stuff uh, come September. I've got a whole slew of um, topics I, I want to cover, uh, some vendors, um, uh, namely, like I said, revolutionary analytics, maybe Caldera might be, or Cloudera might be interested, who knows. Uh, so we're, we're going to try to open it up. Um, anybody got any questions, comments uh, in, in the chat mode? I know it's been a long night, it's been over three hours for some people. Any, anybody at all? Down to 11 people. <laughs> Ram. Like I said, you, you've done an absolutely phenomenal job. I do realize the amount of work you put into this. Uh, as I said, I, I'm just blown away. My socks are totally blown off on what you've done. It's just, just unbelievable what you've done. Um, I hope I see you next Monday. If not, we can email each other. Um, anybody got any questions? I'm going to do a going once, twice, and three times, and then we'll just wrap it up. Anybody? Chat away. I guess I mean, I'll do a going once. Going twice. Oh. Um, okay. Uh, Thompson asked a question about Ram can do Hadoop. Uh, as you can tell, uh, Ram, you want to take that one? Thompson asked about yeah. uh, um, Hadoop. See, um, I've been playing with Hadoop for the last uh, six to eight months now. Um, I've, I've been playing with uh, see my framework. Basically, I work with Python, R, and Hadoop. Um, I use both Python as well as R for running any parallel things with uh, Hadoop. Uh, so I could really run a very um, introductory course to Hadoop. The only problem is the setup gets really, really complex. You need some three, four, five machines where I got to really show you how it's all set up and then how the whole you know, I, I can do it like a single machine cluster and do it in my PC if you, that's okay with you. I can't really show the true uh, show the true power of uh, parallelism with the with the online presentation like this, uh, where I have multiple clusters working. Um, but I could very well do as a single cluster um, application and show show you what's all Hadoop uh, thing about. 
right? And you could imagine yourself running the same thing in five machines and what happens. I, I can, for example, put up the same program when it's done on five machines. Hey, this is the kind of statistics you get. Yeah, I mean, like I said, I'm, I'm going to do a Redis one, which is equivalent to Hadoop. Um, it's not a which is better, which one's worse. It's just which one makes sense for you when you use it. For, paral for parallelization with Redis, it, I was blown away at how simple it was and how effective it is. Um, any other questions? Um, let's redo that going once, twice. Anybody else got any questions? I, I don't want to take up too much of your time. Uh, Ram, I mean, I know it's been three hours for both of us. Okay, so let's do it going once, going twice, going three times. Uh, I guess we'll officially wrap it up. As I said for everybody, um, awesome, awesome night today. Uh, I've learned a lot myself. Ram, again, awesome job. Yep. Thanks. Awesome, awesome. Um, I'll get back to everybody um, on on the follow up of of the video as well as the material, um, and uh, we'll go from there. Uh, Serge says good night to Aust everybody. Good night to everybody. Um, I'll uh, log off now again. Ram, awesome job. Good night. Yeah. Yep. Thompson says night to us as well as everybody else. Um, again, this is a great night. This is, this is one of those game changers for me as well. So again, Ram, thank you so much for doing this. I want to wish everybody best. Good night. Uh, stay on the meetup. Be part of the email group. I don't spam anybody. Ram, again, great job. Uh, uh, and I'll, I'll follow up with you by email and some other stuff as well. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. Um, great, 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 great night. Great night. I'll, I'll leave it at that. Uh, I feel kind of bad having to shut her down, but you know, we gotta. All things, good things come to an end, as they say, right? Okay, so uh, anybody else got anything? Uh, doesn't look like it. All right, so I'm going to wrap it up. I'll, I'll wrap up the webinar again. Thank you very much for coming out. This is a great presentation. Uh, thanks to you, Ram, again. Uh, everybody have a good night. And if you, anyone needs to get in touch with me, uh, I'll just type out my email right here at uh, feedback at quantlabs.net. You can reach me there. Um, and again, thanks again for everybody. Uh, yeah, great night. Okay, have a good night, everybody. Um, and uh, same with you, Ram. I appreciate it. Hope all is well. Have a good night. Bye. Bye. See you, Ram.